from the following question we are required to calculate the amount of cash flow from investing activities now students the machinery as on 31 march 2007 appeared at rupees 5 lakh whereas as on 31st march 2008 the value appearing in the balance sheet is rupees 8 lakh during the year the depreciation charged is rupees 50000 this is given in the additional information and a particular part of machinery whose book value was 1 lakh 20000 was sold off for rupees 80000 using all this information we will now prepare machinery account remember the opening balance is 5 lakh balance brought down 5 lakh and the balance carried down is rupees 8 lakhs now students depreciation charged during the year was rupees 50000 so by depreciation charged during the year this amount comes to rupees Fifty thousand is in fact given to us directly in the additional information. Then during the year, a particular part of machinery whose book value was one lakh twenty thousand was sold off for rupees eighty thousand. That means there is a sale which would be entered as by bank account sale, and this sale is worth rupees eighty thousand. Out of One twenty, the sale value is just eighty thousand. That means there is a loss of rupees forty thousand. You have to draw out this inference yourself. The book value of the asset was one lakh twenty thousand. So that means an asset worth rupees one lakh twenty thousand has now been sold for just rupees eighty thousand. So there is a loss. Thus, loss would be recorded here by profit and loss account. loss on sale which is 40000 so let us total it out 250000 on the credit side out of this 250 we will deduct rather it is not 250 it is a different figure this is 8 lakh so 8 lakh this is 9 lakh 70000 students you you should correct it this figure is 9 lakh 70000 out of 9 lakh 70000 we will deduct 5 lakh and we'll get the balancing figure as to bank which will represent the purchase of assets during the year so 970 minus 5 lakh The difference comes to four lakh seventy thousand, and it represents purchased during the year. So now, students, out of all these figures, this bank account, that is the amount purchased during the year, would be taken as outflow from investing activities. this amount of 80000 that is asset sold during the year would be taken as amount of inflow from investing activities the depreciation of 50000 and the loss of rupees 40000 would be shown as non operating and non cash item while calculating cash flow from operating activities